हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द यूट्यूब चैनल ऑफ चमिली देवी इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ फार्मेसी इंदौर इन दिस सेशन वी आर लर्निंग अबाउट एंटी कन्वर्जेंट सो व्हाट इज एंटी कन्वर्जेंट एंटी इपलेप्टिक्स और एंटी कन्वर्जेंट और स्पेशल क्लास ऑफ ड्रग्स which are clinically useful for the treatment of epilepsy in other words these are a drugs or a medication or a agent which are used in the treatment of epilepsy what is epilepsy epilepsy may be defined as it is a central nervous system neurological disorder in which brain activity becomes abnormal causing seizures or periods of unusual behavior sensations and sometimes loss of awareness the terms epilepsy is a collective designation for a group of chronic central nervous system disorder which is characterized by spontaneous occurrence of brief episodes of associated with brain in addition associated with loss of disturbance of consciousness usually but not always with a characteristic body movement autonomic hyperreactivity seizure what is seizure a seizure is a sudden uncontrolled electrical disturbance in the brain it can cause changes in your behavior movement or feelings and in levels of consciousness if you have two or more seizure or a tendency to have recurrent seizure you have epilepsy these are many types of seizures which range is severity this slide will focus on classification of seizure in previous slide we are learning about seizure this slide will focus on classification of seizures so seizures can be classified into basically two category first is generalized seizure second is partial seizure generalized seizure furtherly divided into four sub category first is generalized tonic clonic seizure absent seizure atonic seizure and myoclonic seizure partial seizure furtherly divided into three category such as simple partial seizure complex partial seizure and simple partial and complex partial seizure secondarily generalized so these are classification of seizure this slide will focus on generalized tonic clonic seizure so what is generalized tonic clonic seizure this is a type of seizure that involve a loss of consciousness and violent muscle contractions a grand mal seizure is usually caused by epilepsy but may have other triggers such as very low blood sugar high fever or stroke the seizure have two stages loss of consciousness occur first and last about 10 to 20 seconds followed by muscle contractions muscle convulsions that usually last for less than 2 minutes absence seizure an absence seizure cause you are blank out or stare into space for a few seconds they have also be called petit mal seizure absence seizure are more common in children and typically don't cause any long term problems these types of seizure are often set off by period of hyperventilation atonic seizure are types of a seizure that cause sudden loss of muscle strength 
these seizures also called akinetic seizure drop attacks and drop seizures the sudden lack of muscle strength or tone can cause the person to fall to the ground the person usually remains conscious and may not always fall down this type of seizure also called atonic seizure myoclonic seizure this consists of considered clonic jerk with characteristic eeg changes eeg means a electroencephalogram changes are types of diagnostic which measure brain activity partial seizure a partial also called focal seizure happens when unusual electrical activity attacks a small area of brain when the seizure does not affect awareness it is also a simple partial seizure simple partial seizure can be motor which affect the muscles of the body now this slide will focus on classification of anti convulsant drug anti convulsant drug are drugs which are used in the treatment of epilepsy so anti convulsant drug can be classified into basic seven category first is barbiturate barbiturate contain phenobarbitone pentobarbitone deoxybarbiturate is second category of anti convulsant drug which contains primidone third category is hydantoin which contain phenytoin drug fourth category is imunostiban which contain carbamazepine drug fifth category is aliphatic carboxylic which contain valproic acid sodium valproate sixth category is benzodiazepine which contain clonazepam diazepam clobazam and seventh category last category is phenyltriazine which contain lamotrigine phenytoin phenytoin is one of the most widely used and powerful anti epileptic drug which does not cause general depression of the cns it is indicated in all types of epilepsies except absence seizure phenytoin is used to control certain types of seizure and to treat and prevent seizures that may be during or after surgery to the brain or nervous system phenytoin is in a class of medication called anti convulsant it work by decreasing abnormal electrical activity in the brain the pharmacokinetics of phenytoin are the drug is absorbed at rather slow rate from the small intestine the absorption is slow after intramuscular injection then after oral administration the dose of phenytoin are 200 to 400 mg daily it single dose is not tolerated then the drug is given two or three divided doses intramuscular injection is not recommended not only because its absorption is slow then after oral administration but also because some drug precipitate occur in muscles the dose of intravenous injection is 1 to 3 mg per kg administered over 5 to 10 minutes pharmacological action of phenytoin phenytoin is a hydantoin derivative as first generation anti convulsant drug that is effective in the treatment of generalized tonic clonic seizure and complex partial seizure also mode of action phenytoin binds to and block active sodium channel reducing the number of sodium channel along an axon or cell body this inhibit high frequency firing through a slowing of channel reprimming and by blockage of persistent sodium current valproic acid valproic acid are medications primarily used to treat epilepsy and bipolar disorder and prevent migraine headache they are useful for the prevention of seizures in those which absence seizure partial seizure 
एंड जनरलाइज सीजर्स ऑल्सो फार्माकोकाइनेटिक्स ऑफ वेलपोरिक एसिड इज रेपिडली ऑब्जॉर्ब फ्रॉम द गेस्ट्रो इंटेस्टिनल ट्रैक्ट बेसिकली वेलपोरिक एसिड इज रेपिडली ऑब्जॉर्ब फ्रॉम जी आई टी पीक कंसेंट्रेशन बींग अटेन वन टू टू आवर्स आफ्टर एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन ऑफ द कन्वेंशनल टेबलेट बट लेटर विद द एंट्री कोटेड टैबलेट The dose of sodium valproic acid in case of complex partial seizures are the initial dose about 10 to 15 mg per kg per day orally and maximum dose about 60 mg per kg per day in case of simple and complex absence seizure the initial dose is 15 mg per kg per day orally and maximum dose is 60 mg per kg per day this slide will focus on mechanism of action and uses of valproic acid all through the mechanism of action of valproate is not fully understood traditionally its anti convulsant effect has been attributed to the blockage of voltage gated sodium channels and increase brain levels of gaba gamma amino butyric acid uses of sodium valproic acid basically it is used in the treatment of bipolar disorder it's occasionally used to prevent migraine attacks and can also be used in treatment of epilepsy this medicine is only available on prescription Thank you so much guys for watching our video I hope you like our video please subscribe our YouTube channel and like our video thank you